Bungie has just dropped a big update and article into Destiny 2 that will remove a ton of FOMO in the game. We're going to be covering this in today's video, and there's a full video of the entire article on the main channel. We have Adept Focusing for Trials and Nightfall Weapons. We'll be seeing the following costs. 1 Ritual Engram, Trials or Vanguard, 50,000 Glimmer, 50 Legendary Shards, 7 Win Ticket, or 10 Adept Nightfall Cypher. So it's a bit confusing there whether or not you could get a Trials Adept from doing Nightfall, but... Um, I believe that's a different path. I believe that's in order to get those uh, separate adepts similar to the uh, focusing you can do right now in the game. But we'll have clarification on that soon from Bungie. They then went over the focusing cost that you have right here. And it says, if a player has not acquired a piece of Trials gear previously, 7 Engrams, 100 Legendary Shards, 10,000 Glimmer. If a player has acquired that, it'll be 3 Trials Engrams, 25 Legendary Shards, and 25,000 Glimmer. So basically, if you don't have the armor piece, it's a lot more expensive if you've never acquired it. If you want to get one of those weapons, for example, the legendary Reed's Regret, that's how you would do so. But keep in mind, you're not going to be able to get the adept versions of this right here. We have the list of weapons, the Shire's Wrath, Reed's Regret, Aisha's Embrace, Burden of Guilt, and the Forgiveness. So that would be for legacy focusing, so keep that in mind. And we'll have to get some clarification because it would seem almost like what you could do is get your 7-win card and have the ability to get an adept you probably have to have unlocked the adept for that week or have to have have a flawless card but it does say on this first one right here that you have a seven win trials ticket 50 legendary shards 50,000 glimmer and one ritual engram so we'll get an update from bungie soon on that one it seems a bit vague but how crazy would it be if you didn't have to actually make it to the lighthouse to get an adept it would be very expensive but it'd be a pretty crazy one the last thing we'll be mentioning is all of these shaders are made available at 801 so the shader fomo is finally up and done this one's been long awaited from the Destiny community because uh, the shader game, the fashion game is real and now you're going to be able to get these. She'll be offering three shaders per week and there's a huge list of shaders here and you can see all of them on screen. One of the ones I really like is that uh, Future Work Holt one there. And uh, that's a wrap on today's video. Let me know your thoughts down below. And again, you can watch the full article on the main YouTube channel, YouTube Lucky Tempe. Make sure to subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Smash the like button. See you in the next one. Later.